Today, we're diving headfirst into the world of hydroponics, especially tailored for beginners. We'll be exploring the fascinating ebb and flow hydroponic system, perfect for newcomers and even seasoned growers. So, what exactly is this ebb and flow hydroponic system? Well, it's a fascinating way to grow your plants without soil. Picture this, your plants are nestled in pots filled with hydroponic clay balls, and they receive a regular nutrient bath. This system fills up about an inch or so with nutrient solution and then drains it back into a reservoir. Now let's break down the essential components of an ebb and flow hydroponic system, starting with the plastic tray and stand. The plastic tray can vary in size, but make sure it has raised and lower areas for optimal root growth. It should be sturdy and level as it'll be holding your precious plants. And remember, choose the right height for your stand to make future harvesting a breeze. Next up, the reservoir. It's a watertight container, often plastic, and it must have a lid to prevent algae growth. Your hydroponic tray will sit on top of the reservoir, so ensure it's easily accessible for watering and nutrient management. The heart of your system, the pump and fittings. This ensures the nutrient solution flows in and out effectively. Be cautious about using clear tubing to prevent algae growth. You may need to drill holes in your tray for fittings, so plan accordingly. Now that you've set up your ebb and flow system, it's time to decide what to grow. Here are some excellent choices. For beginners, annual herbs like basil, dill, parsley, cilantro, and stevia are great starting points. If you're up for a bit more of a challenge, consider growing vegetables like cucumbers, tomatoes, peppers, okra, bush beans, or even strawberries. And don't forget the beauty of flowers. Any annual flowers can thrive and orchids are a popular choice. Now, let's talk about where to place your plants and the importance of the right sized baskets. Each plant needs its own basket or net pot and size matters. Provide ample space for your plants to thrive and feel free to mix round and square baskets to make the most out of your tray. And what goes into these baskets? Hydroponic clay pebbles, also known as hydroton. These serve as ballast and support for your plants. They ensure your plants don't tip over and provide a secure anchor for their roots. Last but not least, don't forget the ebb and flow system is perfect for starting seedlings. Whether you're using rock wool, oasis hydro cubes, coco coir, or soilless mix, this system has you covered. If you like what you just saw, go ahead and click the link in the description to find a full detailed article on this video's topic. And if you learned something new today, hit that like button and let us know down in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe for more hydroponics educational content and visit proponics.co.uk for in-depth articles on all things hydroponics. Grow smarter with proponics. And until next time, happy growing.